Hi friends. Let's learn about the number six. This is the six. And if I use my rec and rec, if you remember, there are five white beads all together on the top and five red beads. So to make six, I slide all of the white beads, which would be five. How many more do I need? One more, that's right. So I slide one red bead. So without counting, I can just look and think five, six. Let's count just to make sure. One, two, three, four, five, six. That would be six. With your fingers, there's different ways to show six. You could put one hand up, because that's five fingers, and one finger on your other hand, six. Can you think of another way to show six fingers? How about four and two? Four, five, six. Can you think of another way to show six fingers? How about three and three? Three, four, five, six. All of those show six fingers. To show six on my 10 frame, I would put a red circle on every square on the top row and one on the bottom row. I'm going to put them on without skipping any spaces. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, whenever you see a 10 frame that has one whole side filled, you'll know that's five. And if there's one more, you just think in your head five, six. So that's six on a 10 frame. I'll show you how to write the number six. If you have something to write with, push pause and get it. Otherwise, you can just use your finger. Are you ready? All right, when we make the six, we start up at the top of our paper or board. We curve around, come back up, and around. Six. Do it with me with your finger. Start at the top, down, up, around. Six. Down, up, around. Six. One more time. Down, up, around. Six. Now, if you have a paper and pencil, do it with me. Start at the top, go down, touch the bottom, go up, around. Six. Let's do it one more time with paper and pencil. Start at the top, go down, touch the bottom, go up, around six. Keep practicing the six and I'll see you next time.